Hey there, Pajama Grandma. Sharon Hornelstrom here. In case you haven't met yet, go ahead and put hashtag pajama in the comments below so I know it's the first time you are hearing my voice or seeing me in my lovely hat today. Today is hat day, only because I totally overslept. It is also day 198 of our daily scare share. Doing one thing a day that scares you, or I'm doing one thing a day that scares me from the book, Do One Thing a Day That Scares You. And today I woke up late and I was scared that I wouldn't be able to do anything with my hair. So I grabbed one of those hats from my Italian food business and threw that on. Because I don't think you really care what my hair looks like anyway, right? Obviously not if you're watching me still because some days it's in curlers, some days it's sticking out all over, sometimes there's gray ones going every which direction. It's just hair and it doesn't really matter. Because we're all here about the daily scare share, not the daily scary hair share. Today is sayings day, love the sayings days. And I found my magnifying glass, so I'm very happy today. I actually had left it on my bed and rolled over on it last night and woke up. So today, and you're going to laugh when you hear this one because it made me laugh, the things I thought about at first. But it is by Rudyard Kipling, so it's probably pretty famous, more famous than I'm aware of. And it says, something hidden, go and find it. Go and look behind the ranges. Something lost behind the ranges, lost and waiting for you, go. Again, Rudyard Kipling. He has a very cool writing style. I like his writing style. But it says, the range I explored today. Now, until I read the range I explored today, the first thing I thought was, oh, something's hidden behind the stove, the range. So obviously I've been in the food business a very long time. And the other thought I had was, as a, a quality control executive for you know a quarter century i was like oh range you know like as in average mean range from low to high what's the low to the high i didn't even think of ranges like home home on the range until third which is kind of funny but it just goes to show you everything about us is colored by our experiences what we've been exposed to or haven't been exposed to in our life colors how we read or impacts how we read and see things and how we interpret what they mean. Something to think about. Something to think about on this day 198. So what does this mean to me? What range can I explore today? What range am I going to explore today? Now I'm going to take some creative license and I might explore the lows and the highs of something, that kind of range. I might go out for a walk on the range, but I don't really live where there's very many ranges. I live in kind of a hilly part of Wisconsin. So I might have to walk on some hills instead of ranges. Or I might go look and see what's under my stove or what's in back of my stove. You never know. Maybe I'll find something marvelous there. So go out. Make it a fantastic day. And I'll see you tomorrow with another Daily Scare Share. Don't be scared, even if you have to wear a hat. Bye.